Welcome to episode 2 of Cornish News. Last episode had a lot of great feedback and you know it was fun hearing all y'all thoughts and opinions you know the people who DM me. But today something happened that I would not have expected to happen. Vincent and Tron might be leaving Iowa. Yeah, I had the same exact reaction because I used to be on Iowa and I wouldn't have never expected Vincent and Tron to leave Iowa because, you know, Vincent has been there since they were the Gators. You know, I have been there since they were the Gators and, you know, Vincent never really showed signs of, you know, wanting to leave the Florida Gators or, you know, Iowa now. But, you know, I'm a Sock fan, girl, and there's rumors going on right now that they're going to be leaving Iowa and possibly going to Miami. But, you know, me personally, I don't really think that's a good decision. So today I'm here to talk about the top five landing spots and what teams they could help and what teams I think they'll do good on. Now, number one, I would have to say the Hawaii Warriors just because... In the Hawaii, I'm pretty sure Tracks ranked them number three on the power rankings, and they're a very solid team. And adding Vincent and Tron to that list is like playoff bound, possibly even Super Bowl bound. Number two, I have to give it to the Georgia Bulldogs just because in the draft they had a lot of opportunities that they could have took, but they missed it and slipped now up. Adding two good wide receivers and a good backup quarterback because you guys know Vincent could play quarterback like hell. He is a very good backup. Adding that to your roster again, playoff bound or Super Bowl bound because you know, again, you have Mr. Heem. Cornish, Gino, and Landry, man. I wouldn't say it will make the team great, but it will give you some pretty decent weapons, and it will make this team a very all-around team. And who doesn't like all-around teams? Number three, I will have to give it to Miami, because, you know, that's the team that people are saying they're going to go to. And, you know, I think they'll fit, you know, pretty well. You know, I disagree with it, but, like, all jokes aside, they will fit pretty well with Miami. And, again, Miami had some very great draft decisions and probably one of the best draft decisions and since they played it smart in the draft adding Vitsa and Tron to that you know this, this team's looking dangerous number four I say they should just stay at Iowa where they got all the chemistry and the connection already set up and planned if they stay at Iowa that team is already Super Bowl bound if they stay at Iowa it's just, it's just going to solidify it all right, they, they might get another chance at the Nationals because, you know, they lost last year against the Vols. Speaking of the Vols, I'll have to put the Vols at number five because, you know, they're not a very good team. You know, adding Tron and Vincent to that list, you know, it'll make the team a little bit better. You know, it'll do something, you know, give you some solid weapons. You know, Vincent could play the quarterback role because, again, he could play quarterback like hell. Vincent, I've been there since day one when Vincent had his first quarterback scrim. He can play great football. But that's it for Corners News. You know, leave a like and subscribe. Let me know what you think about my list and my takes. If you have a better list, put it down in the comments. And yeah, peace.